Welcome back to Nordic Nomad. My name is Mike and today is a beautiful day for an adventure. So we're going to jump right into that. All right, well, we finally made it to the top of the tower after a bit of climbing. I'm a little hot and bothered now because it's nice and sweaty and the windows up here. I didn't realize I had windows up here. I, I don't really know what I was expecting, but big giant windows wasn't it because I've heard that this was exposed. And if you look at the way it was built, the glass is just kind of sitting on top of it. It's not like in it, you know what I mean? Like it's built directly on top of it. So there was after construction, which is great. I've never been up here before myself. Surprisingly, after living here for like, I don't know, what feels like 10 years, I still haven't been up here. And I didn't realize just about anybody could come up here, which means that you can come up here too. So all you got to do is come to the city hall walk your way up through the stairs, talk to the lady, and you'll see, or the, the woman, I don't know, and you'll see the sign on the door that says clock tower, and you'll see that, and then you can see awesome views like that, and there is more stairs here, right up there, but uh, unfortunately, there's a sign right there that says it's, it's, it's unsafe to climb up, so I guess we can't do that today, so because the building was originally built in 1897. Now, that's important because this building actually had a bit of say when it came to child labor, because rumor has it that during the construction of this building, I believe it was an eight-year-old boy had fallen off the roof from up here and died from the fall, unfortunately. And as a result, child labor laws here in Michigan were enforced heavily during that time period to prevent any further deaths, unfortunately. Now, camera might be deceiving and it might not seem like a bit of a height, but we are actually 180 feet off the ground, or at least the tip of this is anyway. So we're probably closer to like, I don't know, 140, but either way, that is still definitely, definitely tall enough to kill you, definitely, far enough to hurt you significantly. Now, if all of this doesn't scare you enough and you still want to come up here and explore yourself, then I encourage you to do so. But keep in mind, there's going to be a lot of stairs. There is no elevator up here. You have to climb all the stairs and you got to be prepared to do that kind of thing. You are rewarded with quite the sight of the city that I'm not familiar with because we don't really have a lot of tall buildings in the city here. This being one of the tallest ones that you're able to just walk into. So if you're able to, I highly recommend you come check this place out because it is amazing. It's your turn now. If you feel like you're up to the challenge to the stairs and the beautiful views, then this is the place for you. And you could just sit up here and chill out for a while or you can do whatever. But it is definitely worth the time. You need to come up here, check it out and do it.